Tatiana is here and welcome to Arambolian's Tuesdays. Because Tuesdays in Arambol are very special. There are amazing sunsets as always, there are drum circle. Some local music events. Yeah. And Russian discotheques with the music of 90s, of 2000s. It reminds me my school time, so I will show you everything. It's gonna be interesting. Banana bread. Yes. Tomorrow. Banana bread. <laughs> yes. First of all, the famous Aramboli sunset. They happen every day, right? But every time you go, there are always something interesting is going on. Acrobatics, musicians, yoga classes. It's the only beach in Goa with this unique vibe. Maybe you can find something similar in Palo Lem, but definitely not in Morjim Baga on Kalungut. The hippies in Goa live in Arambol only, and the sunset here are famous because of this hippie vibe. The drum circle is like a master class in drumming. It starts at 6 p.m. near Love Temple every Tuesday and Friday. Sometimes it's big and wild, and sometimes it's just a small group. You can join with your own drum or as a dancer. I'm not sure if it's donation based, but there are always plenty of people just hanging out and enjoying the energy. After sunset, I usually walk along the main road, watching people, filming my vlogs. I see so, some guys are also like pictures nowadays. Good, good. You are, you are handsome. Your pictures are nice. You are going to Mir. Be careful. <laughs> you going to Mir to party twice in nature or no? Okay, no. You are tourist here or what you doing? I am tourist here. Tourist. Are tourist here. Where from? I am from Maharashtra. Maharashtra. Okay. Yeah. Many people from Maharashtra here in Goa. Do you like it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's your first time in Arambolu or no? No. This is my fifth time. Fifth five. Time. My first time. First time. Yeah. From? First. I'm from Russia, from Siberia. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Something interesting about Arambol is the Israeli food. It's quite trendy here. Maybe it's because of people from Israel make up the second largest community in Arambol after Russians. Or maybe because the falafel plate is pure vegetarian, which fits well with Indian culture. The cheapest falafel in town and a popular hangout spot is Danish falafel. Actually, I visited it for the first time, but I'll probably not return for the falafel plate because I know another place with the best Israeli food in Arambol. Sadly, nobody is sponsoring my videos, but that's why my opinions are always honest. So honestly, Dudo Falafel is one of my favorite spots and I go there quite often. A huge portion of hummus, shakshuk and falafel costs around 300 rupees. Dudu is always packed of people, but they have different seating options, a balcony for the people watching, soft mattresses and standard chairs. It's pretty noisy because it's right on the main road, but you definitely won't feel FOMO here since it's literally in the middle of the action. 
Right across from Dudo is another old and famous spot called Kukiswala. I often show it in my vlogs. It's a great place to soak in the Arambol vibe. <laughs> Here they have music jams every night. It's always good vibe with people chilling and joining on the jams. The only thing I don't like is the smoking. Some people smoke nearby, which makes it hard for non-smokers like me. I've never smoked tobacco in my life and usually I avoid places where smoking is allowed. That's why I found another option for my Tuesday nights. There is beautiful place with an old school hippie atmosphere called Totem. It's located right behind Hangout, about 200 meters from Love Temple. So after the drum circle, you can hit straight there to enjoy live music and good food. The musicians play for donations. These jams happen every Tuesday and Friday, and on Saturday night there is an open microphone. This was a sugar sugar The live jam starts at 7 p.m. and lasts about three hours. By 9 or 10 p.m. You can head back to the beach and check out the famous Russian discotheque. It's packed with tourists from Russia and Kazakhstan dancing and singing their favorite pop songs from the school time, while most domestic tourists are just people watching because this music doesn't mean anything for them, right? After visiting this discotheque once, I decided to make the night even more unforgettable for everyone there. Let's just say I became the cherry on top of the cake. <laughs> I posted the full video of that night including my Russian style dance for my channel members. I think it's really great that not only weekends are full of events in Goa but also weekdays so you can come to Arambol and enjoy your Tuesdays here. I hope you like the video, don't forget like and comment and see you in the next episode.